morning to you and you know what I've got God's word for you this morning and I'm going to share a very powerful scripture with you and this is in 1 John 5 verse 4 let's see what that scripture says it says for whatsoever is born of God overcomes the world and this is the victory that overcomes the world even our faith hallelujah have you ever been wondering how your day is going to turn out maybe you're going out for your job today or you're going out for that business today or you're going to school today or you have a contract and you you don't know how it's going to turn out or you have a meeting with your board members and you 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 fidgeting and you know jittery and you don't know how it's going to turn out you have a job interview and you don't know how it's going to turn out but you know what it doesn't matter the circumstances that are up and against you today it doesn't matter the situation or the opposition that you will be facing today but you know what as you go out as a child of God as the one who is born again let this mindset be in you the mindset of the world he said whatsoever is born of God overcomes the world yes this is the mindset that should be in you the mindset of a champion the mindset of a victor the mindset of an overcomer the mindset of the one who knows that his father is the sovereign of heaven and earth yes for whatsoever is born of God overcomes the world and you as the new creation in Christ Jesus you are born of God Yes, it means you are a chief of the old block. That's what they say. Yes, it means you have the same life that he has. The divine nature is at work in you. And this divine nature is that life that is not subject to defeat, cannot be defeated, cannot be disappointed, cannot go down, cannot, you know, give up. This life that you have is the overcoming life. The very same life that was in Jesus for as he is so are we in this world so as you go out today square up your shoulders put on that smile yes that's on your face that smile of a child of god who know who he is you tell yourself i know who i am i've got a greater one in me for christ in me the hope of glory and you go out with that mentality speaking to yourself letting yourself know who you are and you know what as people see you they'll see the christ in you hallelujah so as you go to that board as you go for the business as you go for the contract go with the mentality of a champion the i can do mentality let the same image that you saw in god's word about you let it go with you don't be like that man who looked at himself in god's word saw who god has made him and when he turned out and went out he straight away forget the kind of man or the manner of man that he was no we are that class of men that don't forget the manner of men that you are because we are new creations in christ jesus we have the life of god in you hallelujah we have the life of god in us so you go out with that mentality knowing who you are yes don't forget don't forget today don't forget the manner of man that you are you are a champion you are a victor you are an overcomer the greater one is at work in you there will be challenges today but i can assure you as a prophet of the most high god that you have been prepared with all it takes to win hallelujah for the christ in you is the hope of your glory so when you face that challenging circumstance when you face that challenging situation you say christ in me the hope of glory glory over this circumstance glory over this situation i pray for you grace is upon you favor is upon you the life of god is charged up in you hallelujah the power of the spirit is functional in you and manifesting in all the place that you set your foot on today the glory of god will be revealed yes grace is upon you and concerning your health issues you who have been having issues with your head i command that sickness to leave you i command that disease to leave you your healing spring forth right now in the name of jesus grace is upon you do you know you know because the life of god that's in you cannot be down cannot be defeated so no sickness can take you down you can die before your time yes let this be your confidence and for you who is not yet born again 
That's what you need to do now. You call upon the name of the Lord. For scripture says, whosoever call upon the name of the Lord shall be saved. So you want to do that right now. You say, Father, in the name of Jesus, I call upon your name. I understand that you sent Jesus Christ to die for my sin as the Lamb of God that took away the sins of the world. Today, I confess Jesus as the Lord of my life. I am no longer for the kingdom of darkness. I am now for Jesus and for his kingdom. You made that prayer from the depth of your heart. You are born again. Welcome to the family of God. Look out for a Bible-believing church in the city where you live and join that church. So you will be grew up and trained in the things of God. If you live anywhere around Padova in Italy or any of the adjoining cities like Ferrara, Vicenza, Rovigo, Mestre, Venice, I want to invite you to come worship with us at Healing Grace Christian Assembly, number 17, Ajeda Vanso and then you know what we will be looking out for you yes on Sundays by 10 o'clock the, uh, the Sunday school starts by 11 o'clock the main service on Tuesdays we have our prayer meetings from between 6 30 and 8 a.m. in the evening we'll be waiting for you with open hands yes ensure also to share this video with all your friends and bless them and do something very unique subscribe to this video on YouTube and turn on the notification bell so that all the subsequent videos and the previous videos you have access to them and be blessed you know what I want to wish you have a great 